Hello everybody. Welcome back to our channel. It has been the craziest 24 hours of baseball life yet. And we've had some crazy 24 hours so far. It is 7 a.m. Monday morning, Memorial Day. And last night, Sunday, I got home from my family trip at around 9.30 p.m. Landed and got back to the house probably around like 11 p.m. And I came back to Baton Rouge because Josh's older sister just had a baby. So I wanted to get a few days with our new little nephew before I went back to Josh this week. So I texted Josh after his game. And I was like, oh, I booked my flight back home and come back Wednesday. And he immediately calls me after the game. And he's like, Claire, I think you're going to have to change your plans because it's happening. <laughs> it is freaking happening. Josh Smith is going to the big leagues, baby. <laughs> I can't believe I just said that. Like, oh, it's like, and ugh, literally that's how I feel. But my older sister did get like a few clips of like him showing us that and like telling us and calling us that I will insert here for y'all to see now. He's joking. He's Come joking. Come on, boy. He's joking. Yeah. night and we're trying to figure out how we were getting my family his family we're both in Baton Rouge right now to Dallas to Arlington to make this game like miss like his dad had to call in like try to figure out how to get out of work his little sister is in Miami right now stuck coming home from senior trip his older sister just had a baby can't come my little sister just went to New York starts her new job today um for the summer my older sister is here thankfully so we're trying to scramble and get everyone that we can figure out our plans there. I literally just booked a flight out because this was all happening at like midnight. So like we couldn't like, there was no help to get last night cause it was night. <laughs> but I literally booked a flight out last night at like 2 a.m. this morning, leaving at, leaving at 10. Hopefully, like I've never been so stressed out about a flight getting canceled in my entire life. My flight leaves at 11 a.m. out of here. I get there. At 12.30, hopefully it does not get canceled because if not, we're going to be cutting it close having to drive. But, yeah. We're going to the big leagues, baby. And the best part is, like, Josh doesn't even know if he's playing tonight. I'll sh they told him after the game last night. Um, so nonchalantly, may I add, by the way. Like, they're literally in a hotel lobby, and I'll add that in right here. What's your, uh, what's your update on his mom?
Yeah, I, I died when I watched this mainly because I'm like I am not there with them. The guilt, I can't believe it. I can't believe this one day that we've been waiting for forever. Like I'm literally not there. But we were saying all in the third last night, all on our face. I'm like, thank gosh, it is perfect time in the sense of like I came home from my trip. I'm not out the country. Josh's old sister is coming home from her trip. His older sister is not in labor. Like, his parents can actually come now because that was like a joke when she got pregnant. It was like, wow, he's going to make it whenever you're literally in labor. But he still doesn't know if he's playing, if he, if like, why he's getting, if getting called up, if like it's like a true term or if someone got hurt or paternity leave. Like, we have no idea. But boy is literally going to be in a uniform tonight. Tonight, 7 o'clock in Arlington. So we were scrambling, trying to get ready. My flight leaves in like two hours and I have so much to do. And I am going with these nubs. And if you know me, you know how I can't talk about it. And I also have, do not have my closet with me. So that is also an issue that is not an important detail. We will figure that out. But yeah, we are hopefully about to figure out a few more plans and hop on a plane and get there to watch my baby play in the major league. <laughs> and we're videoing my phone because we don't have our camera either. So, come on guys. We going baby. We made it. <laughs> this is a warning now for all of the squeals in this video. Trigger warning for this entire video, however long it's gonna be. Me and my sister decided to hop in the car and both get on that 11, 11 a.m. flight. Okay, this garbage man needs to go. We do not have time for that. I was about to say. And we, this flight is hopefully gonna take off so smoothly. Josh's, I'm just gonna call him an uncle for the sake of this video, and a little cousin are already on the way. Josh's mom and dad are about to get in the car and drive, and his little sister just landed her first flight, second flight, going to Dallas. And Josh is about to take off. We still have no idea if he's playing tonight, but who cares? A MLB debut is an MLB debut. If you play for the whole game, you play for one inning, you just run for one base or not. But craziness. And I texted my friends um, that I live with in spring training and they're gonna pick us up from the airport. And we're doing the damn thing, baby. Like I'm not kidding. We were literally just here at this airport less than 12 hours ago. Less than 12. Same bag, same clothes, beach clothes. Literally the only thing that I have. And my hands are still up, so. I have been sitting by the window, stalking our gate to make sure that this plane gets here. Cause this is not gonna not take off and it's here. <laughs> Ta-da! One less stress level gone, or one stress level gone, but there's several left, several left. I'll be freaking out until we get onto this plane. And yes, I still have my iPad. Getting real. <laughs> I don't think I'll fully, the nerves will not fully be gone until this flight is off the ground and then, and then we'll be good. <laughs> We're off. <laughs> and I literally cried that whole entire flight. I was going through all of my old posts of like Josh getting drafted, the trade, his mom's sending baby pictures in the baseball uniform, but we made it. We are at DFW, baby, and I can't freaking believe it. I am so freaking nervous. I don't think I've ever been this nervous in my entire life. I just want to see him. Like, I'm not going to be able to see him before the game. Like, I just, I... Traveling with this bag has never been more appropriate than right now. <laughs> okay, let's go. Let's go.
I got it, I got it, I got it. Go, 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 go. Uh -oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Uh -oh. <laughs> Made it to live at Lowe's or live by Lowe's. Where's the stadium? I think we're on the other side. That's the Cowboy Stadium. Let's go get some champagne. Yeah, they were like, oh, y'all get a free glass of champagne. I'm like, hell yeah, I need that in my life right about now. Oh, and this is after y'all saw the clip of me bombarding Josh. So we literally pulled up at the exact same time, didn't realize it. And he was like, come to this address, come to this address. Like, I can see before I go in. So that was like literally me. We had gotten out the Uber, literally ran into the hotel, dropped our bags like maniacs. And the guy was like, where are you going? We're like, just hold the bags for one second. Got back in the Uber, ran around and like complete chaos. But I'm so glad that I got to see him before. <laughs> and now we need nails, a jersey for this fit. Cause I'm probably just going to wear this and just need a jersey to go over it. And yeah. If you don't know, Globe Life is the stadium, Texas Rangers Stadium, and Texas Live is right next to it, which is like, what, do you, what would you say, like, just like restaurants, a cool, like, big, giant, like, inside area, and there's a gift shop that we're about to go to and bombard to get outfits for tonight, because we don't have clothes! Yes, Literally, like, Josh's sister, you know Carson, his little sister, who's the one that's coming in from senior trip, Miami, whose flight got canceled? She doesn't even have a makeup. She's not coming with a bag. Her bag is still stuck in Miami. She can borrow. Yeah. So. We gotta roll. This is the chaotic life of getting to the major league. Okay, merch, nails, merch and nails. Okay, we're in the game store because like we just said, no one has clothes besides the bare metal. So, this is where we're going. So cute. I'm like, dying off of coffee right now like i i can't breathe but like, uh, so many options we don't even need clothes i'm sure they have texas rangers underwear here like panties uh, this is the fit this is what we're going with here she is Josh Chandler just got in, and we're about just, to go to ba his batting practice and stalk him a little bit more before oh, the game yeah. starts. The rest of the fam is here. We just got some champs. So cheers! 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 Okay, we are en route to the game. About to walk in. And sorry, I had to take a few hours to like decompress. I have never been so freaking nervous in my entire life. We didn't know he was gonna play tonight and he's literally starting at third base. Starting tonight, third base. My husband, Josh Smith. Like, what? Oh my God, so here we go. About to go in. Let's do this, baby. He freaking made it. Here we go. Here we go. Holy moly. 
on, Josh. Come on, Josh. Come on, Josh. In bed. And what are we doing? Rewatching all of them. And just living it over again. And again and again. Just some coffee for my little big leaner. <laughs> we are literally going through all of his Instagram stories right now <laughs> and they're all of him watch of course the nat <laughs> him <laughs> like literally these aren't even his DMs this is just straight up Instagram stories Like, how crazy is that? Thank you guys for the support. <laughs> I'm so tired. 
I just asked Josh if we should close out the vlog. He goes, am I even in it? I feel like I haven't even seen you. Trust me, it's been all about you. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, no, we didn't film that much after the game last night because we were trying to soak it in because did you think yeah. it would ever go that way? Well, no, I didn't. I haven't even checked my phone really until today. I kind of want to just enjoy. How many mess? He has like last night, yeah. 350 messages. I got a lot, but um, last night was crazy. Yeah. I didn't want to go to sleep because I didn't want the <laughs> feeling to end. But. Wait, tell him what, what was... Like, what were you expecting? What were you wanting out of last night? I mean, the whole... Bare minimum. I, I wanted at least one hit. Like, just one. Just get that out of the way. Just get that pressure off. But, um, what this happened, so... <laughs> that was crazy, and, uh... I mean, it was just a dream come true, really. I mean, our phones were blowing up from home. It literally felt like everyone was watching from home, and just everywhere. Even, like, social media. Like, the amount of people that, like that like tagged us that we're watching that like we don't even know it's like are you i just couldn't believe that people like actually like cared enough to like turn it on to watch josh yeah and i think claire got more tv time than me <laughs> okay but like i swear i was shocked some girl when i first got there some girl like literally like swept me away and like took me to like the family room and like took like a picture for like a pass to get That's back funny. i almost said backstage <laughs> but then no at the beginning of the game too some girl texted me and was like what section y'all sitting in for broadcasting <sighs> and then once people started like texting us pictures of us like when he was hitting and stuff that's what I thought it meant and then this lady came over like full blown interview ready and, I, and all of our family and friends were like what's going on she literally walked in with a microphone in the middle of the stands and when I tell you people around us were like videoing with flashlights me and all my literal thighs were shaking I was so nervous yeah so Claire did her part um I did mine, I guess, but I thought that was pretty funny how a bunch of people were, like, asking me about my wife after the game. I'm like, this is my debut. <laughs> Claire's got more TV than me. Oh, it's, we have, like, a little family. But it's fun. It was everything you dream about. Um, it was, I'm still kind of just speechless, but just waking up the next day, reading through all my messages, uh, the support from everybody has been unbelievable, and, uh, <sighs> I don't know. What was better? I Last mean, night or a wedding day? You can answer that one. <laughs> I know. And I was like, what's better? I can't even, I, don't, I really don't well, even know. Well, if you can't decide, then last night. <laughs> <laughs> we'll go for that. For now, we'll go for that right now. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I love y'all. Thank y'all for the support. Um, it was the best day I could imagine. Uh, we love you guys. Thank y'all. And make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And don't forget to follow along for hopefully a whole lot more. Mwah.